sitting in the car, not even pulled up to the station yet. This is, this is going to be a run. Should we get out and run? Today started ridiculously early. So naturally, we were ridiculously late. We're going to check out a new city today in China, Hangzhou. What's the big deal? We made it. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. Harley, would you like a lemon juice? Oh, yes, please. Lemon juice. Okay, so who did I drive with me on this adventure? First up, Penny. Guarantee you won't see her off her phone this entire trip. Then we have Kelly. She speaks Mandarin and can basically bail us out if something goes wrong. And then there's Nicolette, whose bag is full of secrets. I think this is our stop. We gotta go. Not really feeling my outfit. I see everybody with all these like cute kind of like two-piece suits. I might need to go shopping. I don't know what it's like here in Hangzhou, but I feel like a shopping trip might be in our 24-hour schedule. We didn't exactly choose the best day for outdoor activities. It basically poured all day long. I'm gonna try this breakfast pastry, I'm watching them make it back here. and delicious breakfast to go. I have my breakfast walking through this market and I see this fruit, which I've just been told is the stinkiest. This fruit apparently is banned from all airports, trains, everything because it smells so bad when you eat it, but it's very popular. I'm not gonna have that. Let's stick to my fried dough. Our first stop was Hu Ching Yu Pharmacy, which, founded in 1874, is a pharmacy for traditional Chinese medicine. The prescriptions look like magic potions. It smells so good in here. Whoa, are those mushrooms? This is a fungus. That is a fungus. They're weighing out all of the prescriptions. So like if you have a prescription for you know, a quarter pound of bee pollen. They put in a quarter pound of bee pollen. Next, we ventured to Ching Hefeng Ancient Street, famous for its shopping, and it did not disappoint. Wow, thank you. Fresh sugar cane juice, straight from the root. A little piggy at the market. Pork. That's a walnut candy, I think. I would find the candy and the store. No matter where I am, no matter what language. I'm eating random things that I find on the street for free. This is not a good idea. Ooh. It smells it's the inside of a payday. It's like peanuts and sugar and probably just peanuts and sugar. Mm. Oh, we need to buy those. Those are good. What is this? I have no idea what this is, but I really want to try it. So we made it to Westlake. It's a little bit rainier than I had imagined, but it's beautiful. Westlake is a big attraction in China because of its beauty and serenity. It's said that many poets and painters have come here throughout history seeking inspiration. On this trip, we signed up for Tai Chi lessons at Tai Chi Zen, a center founded by Jack Ma and Jet Li. This should be interesting. So the final stop on our tour today in Hangzhou is a Tai Chi lesson, and we have 
the amazing Jason here to teach us what to do. Tai Chi movements to we just use our body to show how the Tai Chi philosophy it is. Take deep breath in here and breathe out. And relax your chest. Yeah, uh, yeah. 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 Uh, yeah.